Do you want a big fat ticket? Then do what this driver just did. Okay, I do have the site for passing the school bus with the lights on. You would stay inside your car, keep your seatbelt on for safety, give me about five minutes and I'll be right back with you, okay? In fact, in just 20 minutes, five separate drivers ignored state law and passed a school bus with flashing red lights, picking up children. It just so happens I'm out with traffic officers from the California Highway Patrol and the East Palo Alto Police Department. The bus lights flash, the red lights are flashing, we need to stop. <laughs> At 200 feet from a school bus stop, the driver turns on the amber lights. And once the bus stops, the red lights come on. Once the red lights come on, drivers are required by state law to stop and stay stopped in both directions until the lights go off, unless it's a divided highway. If you don't stop, you get to have a chat with a police officer like the driver of this Prius. 1961? Mm -hmm. Okay. She failed to produce a driver's license when asked, but it gets worse. It turns out she's been cited twice before, so... Okay, it's being towed. Okay, it's going to be impounded for 30 days. Or the driver of this white Jeep. Are you aware that you're supposed to stop for the... when the school bus has the lights yeah, out? Yeah. How come I, you didn't stop? I didn't see, sorry. You didn't see it? Okay. Yeah. Now listen to this. If you don't see the bus or stop for the bus with the flashing red lights that are dropping or picking up kids and an officer catches you? Okay. You gotta remember in both directions you got to stop for the school bus, okay? Ticket? Yes. If you can please sign the red box. You will get to go on your way with a $700 moving violation with a point attached. In East Palo Alto, Stanley Roberts, Cron 4 News.